Hello, this is HSN by 7 ap 5 here today, and I'm going to be reviewing the Kaber SR10. As you can see, this box design is very different from the other model um, past years we had. This is the 2013 model, so new rollout and everything. This has the um, red stripe instead of the gray, and it also has a new quilt. This is performance built in one of the night. Anyways, it's still Kaber and everything, and now let's open this box and Man, it was in here! Hey, for some Now we're gonna go on to the gun. This is the Game of SR10 2013 model. And I'll start from the stock to the flash hider. So, I'm gonna come over here. Now let's open up the stock, because this is where it gets is different from all the other years. As you can see, the um the, the fuse is still over here, but it's screwed in to um to the wire so that it's more secure. And it also has a lot more wiring, so you might have some trouble trying to stick in stick bipoles like this. I kind of got lucky with mine. So let's put this butt plate back on. Really simple. Probably the most simplest crane sock out there. And it's six adjust positions adjustable, so the first one's all the way close. Second one, third one, fourth one, or fourth one, fifth one, sixth one. Count to your children. Apparently, though, it's missing all the numbers, you know, like the original. I guess not the original, but the two GX Gateways had, so I kind of missed that. And the Gateway pre-lubed it so it slides really well. So when you're in combat, it's easier. Hold on a sec. Okay, I'm back guys from children. And where was I? Okay, now I'm done with the stock, now we're gonna work um work on the body here. Like sex. Charging functioning charging handle, but no bolt catch still. I wish they had that in. Um still some type of gray. As long as it, like over here too, still gray. I like that. Not full black. The trades now are not painted on, they are lasered. Fire my lasers! And it comes with a pistol grip, not like this Magpul one, it comes with a standard M4 pistol grip, which I think is lame. The body itself is, I think it's different from the um, the other models, the past years. I think the, I guess the, et not etching, but the design is a little more sharper than the other ones. It seems, I don't know, it just pops out more than the other ones to me. And probably the biggest di difference between the other models the 20, this 20, 2013 model and the other ones is probably this mid cap mag that it comes with. It comes with the K120 mid cap polymer magazine and it feeds really well and I I love it. Now we're going to go to this rail system. 10 inch rail system, hence SR10. It, it I think it might be lighter than the other years, I'm not sure, but the design is the same, how it um, looks and everything. I covered it all up because it's my stuff. And it doesn't wobble anymore, but like maybe some other people's guns from last year, they might have been wobbly, but this year's ones are all solid. So, good job, KBA. Standard gas block, doesn't get in the way of your sights. And now, find the flash hider. This is my flash hider, but, um, yeah, this is mine, but it comes with a standard one with orange tip, with orange paint on it. Now, to the firing, the rate of fire and FPS, it shoots a good, what are you doing? You're back. Motherfucker, get out of my seat! Shoots about 20 rounds a second. And, yeah. At around solid 400 FPS with 0.2 gram BBs. Now we're gonna do a shooting test. All right, I'm back, and we are at my makeshift range. And I got my SR-10 with loaded with 0.2s with the mag, and now we're gonna be shooting at that target. Oh, cameraman, look at that. There's the other guy too over there. He's me watching that. All right, you go. Well, uh, wait, wait. Let me get a picture of the target. Uh, so we're not looking for, I guess, shooting at the target in general. Just looking for groupings for accuracy. So I'm gonna start firing now.
I'm missing a fucking target. Now we're gonna go full auto. And now you're gonna watch this mag dump to see you know the efficiency of this mag. Unlike other mid caps, you might have some extra BBs lying around. This one, none. And watch. So that's empty. Well, there's mag BBs, but empty. All right, as you can see, the damage is pretty good with this um, human Godzilla. The groupings are pretty tight from 50 feet away back at our I guess, little firing station. This is the full auto burst, obviously. This is really controlled for, for the distance that we shot at. And we were around 100 feet, or maybe even 200 feet. It's maybe about the size of this pizza box, so it's really good compared to you know, the size of the body. So you're gonna be able to hit your targets pretty far. Got a headshot. Two headshots, actually. So if you want to hit somebody's ball sack, go right ahead. And yeah, cut. So give me the camera. Action! $30 edition. I'm playing various or 10 with the 552 view effect. And Meg from the system. Let's do it. 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 